if they would just get over this. Mm-hmm. But this is the this is the marketing point. I mean, this is this is the sales point right here. I mean, it's just like um, I, I don't know if I've talked about it on this show or not, but it, it's like cosmetics. When you sell cosmetics, right? There was like a commercial one time for colored cosmetics. I mean, colored uh, was it eye contacts? Well, if you're gonna sell colored eye contacts, right? The color you don't want to sell is brown. Because most people have brown eyes. So if you're selling color contacts to change people's eye color, you want to sell two people with brown eyes to sell them another color. And so they ran ads that insulted people with brown eyes. And I noticed this because I have brown eyes. So I'm watching the ad, and it's got this beautiful woman. It's describing all these attributes of this beautiful woman. It gets to her eyes, and it says something like, you know, and her eyes are like mud. And I was like, oh, excuse me, that's my eyes right there, right? And I don't think my eyes are ugly, and so I don't know why you're telling me this. Like, you're insulting my eyes, and and you're insulting me in order to sell me something? Like, I'm supposed to buy a product from you after you come on TV and insult me, right? But this is how the cosmetic industry works. You have to convince people there's something wrong with normal in order to make them buy cosmetics. Your eyelashes are not long enough. Oh, really? Like, what are the average? What is the average length of a freaking eyelash, right? Um, and I think it's like, uh, I remember seeing at one point, this was years ago, that uh, most women in the U.S. have, for example, like size B breasts, and most of the breast enlargement is to a D. And it's like, okay, so women are getting oversized breasts in order to look, what, normal? I, they already look normal. Right? They're already normal. It's like it, nobody's getting breast enlargement to make themselves normal. It'd be like going in for a nose job and getting your nose three inches long. Like, who does this, right? But you, you convince the people that normal is not okay, mm-hmm. and then you sell them abnormal, right? And this is what religion does, or it, these types of religions. You take something that's like a normal attribute, like sex, and you convince people that there's something wrong with it. If, if you were selling a religion that said you're okay as you are, you wouldn't sell to anybody. There's a lot of hippie religions like that. <laughs> You're fine how you are. But the point is, I mean, the ones that are proselytizing hard That's and true. pushing hard yeah. are the ones that are convinced that there's something wrong. The, the, you know, the, the hard sell religions are selling you that being normal is wrong. You know, that being a normal human being is wrong. And they even start with you. Know, that's, what, that's what they start with. Oh, we used to be okay, but then Adam and... And now we're all messed well, up, and everything well, yeah. that you are is all messed up. Yeah, I mean, this is the this is the message that Jehovah's Witnesses tell you when they knock on the door. You know, one of the first things out of their mouth is always, "Don't you agree that the world is deteriorating and things are getting <laughs> yeah, worse all the do. time?" That's their pitch. And they're fucking astonished when I tell them, "Well, no. As a matter of fact, I think we're living in one of the most yeah. peaceful times in the history of humanity." Yeah. And they look at me like, what? Yeah. You know? Yeah, I pointed out one time, I was like, hey, we're no longer holding slaves. I think that's a step <laughs> yeah. in the right direction. I was like, if that's not a step up, what is? I mean, that's a that's an improvement, wouldn't you say? Yeah, yeah we're not crucifying people anymore. Yeah, no doubt. That's a big step forward. <laughs> you know, stone, we're not stoning as much. It's only certain areas, you know. We're, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we got lots of uh, good medicines we didn't used to have. Yeah. and We beat polio. No, leprosy yeah, well, is well, uh, you know very we low. Mostly, we're not being polio. We're not doing too good on it. U.S. Yes. Yeah. Um, well, yeah, you can't. You know, but I mean, that's better than at least you yeah, got some areas. Better I mean, than it used to be. The thing is, it's you know before you had nothing, you just died from stuff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, things have gotten a little better. Yeah. Ever since we started like totally fucking with God's will, things have gotten better for us. That's true. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. yeah. 